In an effort to battle human trafficking, the 21 Heart for Freedom is hosting its first Students Against Trafficking to teach and empower young adults to understand what it is and how to recognize it. Here with us in studio is Julie and Brooke, and they're going to tell us all about this amazing event that's happening. Good morning. How Good are you morning. all? Good morning. Thank you. Thanks, Tim, for having us. Yeah, and we were just talking a little bit about it. Now, you guys are hosting the summit, but you don't work for A21. You guys are just partnering together. Correct. So I started a team in Charleston to advocate for A21 to help um, just raise awareness on human trafficking. And I had met Brooke along the way. And Brooke works for the Tri-County Task Human Trafficking Task Force. So we're partnering on an event. And Brooke, what do you do with the task force? The task force is multidisciplinary, so we're bringing in law enforcement, <coughs> community members, teachers, all mandated reporters to really have a collaborative and effective holistic response to address this issue in our area. Um, and the state definition just changed in April to um, amend the definition of child abuse and neglect to include sex trafficking. So since April, all mandated reporters, so all teachers, school administrative staff um, are required to identify and report on trafficking and teach on trafficking. So that's one of the reasons we're having this youth summit to kind of supplement their efforts mm -hmm. to, um, to identify and learn about this issue. And it sounds like you have a lot of professionals who will be on staff to talk at the summit. So what's one thing you want the students to take away from the whole event? Sure. Um, education, I think, and empowering them um, on protecting themselves. First, learning what human trafficking is, what are some signs that they could be watching for in terms of their friends, what are some, um, what are some situations that they need to be mindful of to protect themselves. Um, so education and then em empowering them to be safe. And you guys will have some guest speakers at the summit, so what will they be talking about? They'll be talking about some of the signs, um, and really it's so much of the grooming and the even soliciting is happening online. And students know, they, they know what their peers are doing online be better than any of us ever will. So we really want to empower them with knowledge and then give them the action steps for how to report um, and really uh, put in that, instill that message of being an upstander and standing up for your peers and really being a, a strong, like, proactive kind of friend. Um, and Julie, do you want to tell them the, some of the speakers that we have? We're so excited. Sure. So we are um, honored to have uh, a stunt performer from the Black Panther, Cyrus oh, okay. Roach. So he mm -hmm. will be a, a motivational speaker. Um, he will speak on just kind of that being that upstanding person and um, then followed by him we're going to have Lindsay who is a survivor mm -hmm. um, of human trafficking in the Charleston area and then we also are going to have a police officer from Hanahan that's going to um, speak to the kids on social media. Well it sounds like there's going to be a lot of people there yes. a lot of great food resources. Trucks. Food trucks. Yes raffle prizes. And this is all happening January 11th <clears throat> so this Friday and it's at Seacoast Church correct? Correct. In all Mount right. Pleasant. All right. Seacoast Church in Mount Pleasant. Thank you guys so much Thank for being you. here with us. We'll Thanks, be right Tampa. back.